guys, welcome back to Cindy's Cuisine. Today I'm making red Thai curry. I'm making it with chicken. Feel free to make it with tofu. If you're looking for a great recipe for the fall, this is the one for you. Hi guys, we're back in the grocery store today and today we are in the produce section once again. Right here you can find pre-packaged carrots and some of the other items that we are gonna be needing for today's recipe. We also have cauliflower, broccoli, chopped onions, feel free to add the vegetable of your choice. I have beautiful bell peppers. Look at all the beautiful colors. Now I am in the Asian section of the grocery store and I am looking for my coconut milk. This one is very good. I've used this several times before. You wanna have coconut milk in your red Thai curry. Let's see if we can find the red curry paste. Here it is. The red curry paste. And that's what I'm using for this recipe today. So I'm gonna get ready by getting my ingredients prepped. So I'm gonna start by cutting my onions. And with this dish, you could add the vegetable of your choice. I love bell peppers and broccoli. And today I'm gonna to be using carrots carrots and snow peas, and a little broccoli. I'm just gonna break them with my hand. Little pieces. The last time I made it, I added cauliflower and mushrooms. So my chicken is ready. I've chopped it into little bite-sized pieces and I've added a little bit of salt, pepper, and a little drop of vinegar because that's my preference. It's optional. So we're gonna start by turning our stove to medium heat. On medium heat and then I'm gonna add my oil. And we're gonna let it heat up for a little bit. I'm gonna start by adding the chicken to the oil. Chicken breast, boneless, skinless chicken breast. And I have four small chicken breasts. And I'm gonna let it cook for a little bit before I add the other ingredients. My curry paste. This red curry paste is so delicious. I wish you could smell it. It has basil, lemongrass, and all the good stuff that makes red curry so delicious. Now, I'm 
I'm gonna add my coconut milk. And these are ingredients you could find at your local grocery store. And since I am cooking for a nice size group this evening, instead of one can of coconut milk, I'm gonna add a little bit more. I've allowed it to cook for like 15 minutes, and now I'm gonna add my vegetables. Oh, look at it. It looks good, it smells good. I got kind of happy with the vegetables this evening, guys. Now, I'm gonna add my carrots, not the whole bag. And my, my snow peas. And I'm gonna let it simmer for a little while longer. So it's looking really good. And it's almost ready, look at it, guys. Right, guys now we're gonna try this delicious curry it's very hot I'm gonna take my time let's get a little taste mm. Mm, perfect yum well guys thanks for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit that bell